Welcome to a new Red Bits video. Today's case is a quick case on chest imaging. When you see the sign, please pause to think about the images. This is a chest x-ray on a young patient. Pause here. Findings. The x-ray may appear normal at a first glance. However, it's very important to have a systematic approach and to look at the periphery of the film. Inspecting the peripheral osseous structures reveals that the acromioclavicular joint has an abnormal appearance. Now let's enlarge this area and look carefully at the joint. The first thing you notice is that the distance between the acromion and clavicle is widened. The second thing that you notice is that the edge of the clavicle is L-defined denoting resorption. Now let's look carefully at the contralateral side. Although it's partially visualized on this radiograph, you also notice that there is an L-defined appearance of the lateral aspect of the clavicle. There are several differential diagnostic possibilities for such an appearance. However, there are three important ones that you have to know. The first is trauma in what's called traumatic acroosteolysis. The second is resorption in hyperparathyroidism and the third is erosive changes in the context of rheumatoid arthritis. The diagnosis in this case was hyperparathyroidism secondary to chronic renal failure resulting in bilateral resorption of the distal clavicles. There are two take-home points from such a case. The first is always look at the periphery of the film and include the acromioclavicular joint as part of your hidden areas. The second point to know is that the differential diagnosis for resorption or absence of the distal clavicle is a very important one, whether being in the context of real life or in examinations. The most important three to know are trauma, hyperparathyroidism, and rheumatoid arthritis. Thanks for watching. Please support our Radiology Bits account by sharing our videos, subscribing to our YouTube channel, liking the clips, joining our Radiology Bits Twitter account at at red underscore bits, or even joining our new Snapchat account. See you later.